welcome or welcome back to Penny's Two Cents. It's your girl Penny and today I have my father with me. Hi everyone. Guys, we are trying something new. We went to a Caribou Coffee, okay? So Caribou Coffee has been around for a while, um, but it, it just came to our area not too long ago and I found out about it. So we gotta do Caribou Coffee. We gotta try it out. It's a lot like a Starbucks. It's a lot like a Starbucks. Ours has a drive through it has an app and all that. I haven't gotten the app yet, so I'll have to try the app out. But I'll tell you what we got really quick. Um, I'm going to get Dad started on his. Uh, I guess I got to find it. So, like I said, it's like a Starbucks. I got a malted mocha coffee. It is, a, I got it in a hot. You can get these in iced, blended, hot. You got a lot of options here. I also got a boosted peach black tea. I got that iced. I'll show them to you here in a minute, guys. Um, Dad wanted the sausage, egg, and cheddar biscuit, so I got him that. And I got the ham, egg, and Swiss. I'm not sure what mine was on. I think mine's on a croissant. Um, I had to change up the yeah, order a little yeah. bit because I went on the website and they didn't have some of the sandwiches that I was wanting to try. So I kind of had to switch it up a little bit. I also got a pumpkin cake pop. So we're going to be trying that. I also got Dad a black coffee, a blonde black coffee, so it's their lighter roast of black coffee. Let's see if I can find Dad's biscuit really quick to get him started. And you know me, I got to talk, guys. I got to talk through the other stuff. Let's see if I can find Dad's biscuit. Yep, okay. So it's all wrapped up nice in uh, oh, okay. like a wax paper thing. Let's, let's look at it really quick. If you're new to the channel, we always like to make you guys aware. Dad has macular degeneration, guys. It's a progressive vision loss. He can see light and dark, but he can't make out detail. So I check his food for him. My hands are sanitized, so I just don't want anybody getting mad. Let's check this out, though. It's a biscuit. It's a decent size. The sun's not going to let you guys see it. It's a decent size biscuit, about the size of the biscuit sandwich from McDonald's is what size it is, Dad. I'm not going to tear it apart. It's got an egg in here, cracked egg. Um, cheddar cheese, a sausage, and a buttery looking biscuit. I'm going to give that to Dad and let okay. him get it. It is hot, hot, hot. It is hot. Yeah, it's Ooh. hot, hot. I'm going to put some napkins on your on your lap because I didn't do that before we got started. So Dad's biscuit sandwich, guys. I always like to give you the prices, okay? And Dad, we're going to have to move this camera just a little bit. Yeah, there it is. So we don't lose poor dad. I got set stuff up on the... Guys, I got so much stuff in my hands. <laughs> so dad's biscuit sandwich I just showed you. Sausage, egg, and cheese is $5.09 here in Ohio, guys. This um, this one, if, if you're in the Ohio area, the Columbus, Ohio area, this caribou is in Reynoldsburg, Ohio. So... If you're interested to try them, that's where it's at, Reynoldsburg. Before I try my sandwich, I wanted to show you something. So I got a pumpkin cake pop. I thought they were a little bit bigger than Starbucks, but it looks about the same size as Starbucks. I'm going to try that here in a little bit, but a pumpkin, a pumpkin cake pop. I get. I don't even know what sandwich I ended up getting. I think it's a croissant. I'm trying to get it out of here or not drop it. So yeah, I got a ham, egg, and Swiss croissant. Guys, this is this is challenging today. It really is. So the croissant looks a lot like um, Starbucks croissant. It's kind of sliding sideways. It's got ham and Swiss cheese, an egg. It looks like the egg has some pepper on it. I gotta get some bites off of this thing. I'm starting to get shaky because we haven't ate. Cheese on the side of my face. This was six dollars and nine cents, guys. Six dollars and nine cents. This 
sauce is pretty decent. I like the Swiss on this thing. That on croissant is pretty good, it's buttery. The top of the croissant feels like they heated it up a little too much and it got a little tough, you know what I mean? But the egg is good in that. The Swiss cheese in my hand was good in that. I'll be eating more, but I wanna drink some of these drinks and I just don't wanna to get too full at the moment, okay? But it's a very, it's a fairly decent uh, breakfast sandwiches. I'm not big on breakfast sandwiches, guys you know, out. I like breakfast sandwiches at home because you put all the good stuff on it, you know. But I'm, I'm going to explain our rating scale before I even rate anything. And Dad knows he's thinking about his score for his sandwich. Um, our rating scale, guys, is a five or lower is that thing is garbage. Don't waste your money. Get something else, okay? A six to a seven is this, uh, we'd eat it, but we really wouldn't recommend it. Anything above a seven, we recommend. The closer it gets to a 10, we highly recommend. And we rarely give out 10s, guys. We only give out 10s that special something that knocks our socks off. That's something that tastes so good, we can't imagine it tasting any better. Then that's what we give out a 10. Now, this little um, egg and ham and Swiss, Swiss croissant, um, I didn't like it that the top was a little tough like they they heated it up too long okay but the flavor of the thing was really good if that top wasn't a little tough I would give this thing a higher score so I just want you to know the flavor of this thing is really good okay um, I'm gonna have to give it like a 7.75 I think if the top wasn't too the croissant wasn't too tough I would have given it an 8 um, but I gotta give it a 7.75. I think it's a decent sandwich. Now the prices are up there, guys. All these places are taxing. Honestly, I think it's cheaper than Starbucks though. But that's just where we're at with that. Do you wanna think a little bit longer or do you want me to? Give me a little bit of coffee. Okay, so I got dad a uh, black coffee. Ooh, it's pretty hot today. This is, oh, this is really hot. This is super hot. I just want you to know it's super hot. Okay. Because I can barely hold the cup. That's how hot it is. I don't know if you're going to be able to get a drink right now. Okay. Turn, turn. Okay. I'm trying to get the hole for him, that our guys. But it's super hot, babe. Super hot. I told you it's super hot. Okay. It's hot. Okay. It's, but let, let's, it's hot. Okay. Let's let it cool down for a minute. Do you want to drink your soda that oh, we got? Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty it good. Tastes good so far. Yeah. Okay. Um, what do you want to say about your? What do you get to say about that biscuit? The biscuit so is good. Mm -hmm. The excellent biscuit. I'll tell you what. It's nice and flaky. The like. better biscuit. The better biscuit than I've made in a long time. Okay. Uh, the sausage was good. Mm -hmm. The egg was good. The cheese was good. Yeah, it looked like I, really good I, cheddar everything, cheese. Everything about the sandwich was good. Like, it looked like it was a decent cheddar. Could you taste that cheddar? Yes, I could. And, and the you pepper, liked it in it? And the pepper, pepper and okay. seasoning on okay. it. Uh, it was really a good sandwich. I, 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 can't, I can't complain about the sandwich. I mean, the price is a little bit the higher. The prices, yeah. Um, if you were to compare it to like McDonald's biscuit sandwich, did you like this one better than you like a McDonald's biscuit sandwich? Uh, no, I would prefer this one okay. the biscuit uh, better than McDonald's on any one. Okay, so how did the sausage taste to you? Because I know you like to critique the sausage. Did it have a good sausage flavor? Was it a little? It had a good, it had a good sausage sandwich uh, flavor. It had a good. Uh, down uh, country style. Oh, uh, like country style. Okay, okay. And uh, it was it was really good. It was really a good sandwich. What's I, uh, I don't know. Uh, what score? I did it be a nine. A nine? 
Okay, so while we're letting some of these drinks cool, guys, I just wanted to say there's 400, when I when I did this research, there was 427 locations at the time I did this research um, in the U.S. in 19 states. So see if you've got a caribou coffee. If you have a caribou coffee and you've tried it, please comment below what's your favorite drink from there what's your favorite sandwich they got a lunch they got breakfast they got the breakfast sandwiches you can get all day long um comment below is there something there that you would love to try or have you tried you love to see us try leave that in the comments i want to do a real quick drink of this this is let me get it right this is their boosted peach tea black tea Bo boosted peach black tea I can't talk guys you can get it iced and you can get it blended I just got it iced um, it's boosted with coffee the caffeine from coffee um, and it's got ginseng and I can't say this other word guys guarana guarana uh, I don't know but it's 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 a it's a energy boost you can I get, know what ginseng you is can, yeah you can get it without the energy boost but I, I wanted to get it boosted so let's let's try this thing out Tastes pretty good. Oh, uh, you know what it tastes like. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds pretty good. It sounds um, pretty good. I wish I, I had know. something I do. I kind of want to stir it up because all I tasted was the tea at the top. Oh, okay. I want to stir this thing up. And I'm trying to do... It sounds, it sounds pretty good. Yeah, pretty I don't good. know. <laughs> Dan's saying it tastes pretty good. He didn't even taste it. I, I mean, I mean it sounds, it sounds but really yeah, good. Like a, Tea. Yeah. It needs a little more sugar for me. So I can't drink this tea without any sugar. No. You did the. You did the sugar. I, I think you can. I could think you can add sugar there. I didn't because I thought maybe the peach would give it enough sugar for me. It's just not quite enough sugar. I like the taste of their tea though. And I like the peach in it. Uh, if I wanted to get this again, I would tell them to add sugar to it. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to give you guys a score of how it tastes, okay? I'm, I'm wanting the sugar, okay? But I'm going to tell you that I think with the sugar in it, I would give this thing an 8. So I got to give it an 8. I, I would just ask for some sugar next time. I mean, I, it's not quite an 8 without the sugar. But the tea and the peach is pretty good. I might even ask them to like put a little extra peach flavoring in it because I yeah. like that. Because it's kind of faint. Think it is, I think it's a little bit sugar, more sugar. A little more sugar, and I would bring out the peach. Yeah, but... yeah, oh yeah. Or if I had split, I would see if they had Splenda probably. But yeah, that's that's, that's an eight. It's an eight. It's okay. How much did they charge me for that? Yeah, I don't know. Let's see. Four dollars and sixty nine yeah. cents for that small guys. Okay, and I did get a, I had to get a coffee type thing. I got, and this one sounded so interesting to me. I got it in hot. You can get it iced. You can get it blended. I got a malted mocha, guys. A malted mocha. It's supposed to be made with real ch melted chocolate, steamed milk, espresso with malted milk powder in it, whipped cream and chocolate chips on top. I don't know if they put the chocolate chips or not. Well, it's, it's whipped cream that it's you know melted of course now watch me not get the lid back on good okay I gotta get a drink of this I'll probably burn my tongue yeah mm. hold on mm. it's pretty good oh my yeah well, hold on <laughs> that sounds good <laughs> I think you would like this, Dan. Okay. Like a hot chocolate? Uh, it's kind of like a hot chocolate, okay? It's got a little bit of that coffee flavor, mm -hmm. but it's got like that, you know, like a malt, like that malt stuff they use in malted um, milkshakes? Yeah, shakes. I know what you mean. It's got a slight taste of that in the, in the cool, or the cool, the whipped cream on top, adding to it. I definitely got to let you try one of these next yeah, time. You got to try, try one it. of these. I got to put that in my memory. I think you would like it. He likes hot chocolates. It's not as it's not as sweet as a hot chocolate, okay? Oh, gosh. This thing's good. I would get this again. Um, Score-wise, I got I to give this a 9. 
9.5. I think it's a 9.5. How much did I spend on this? Oh. Oh. Five dollars and sixty nine cents, guys. It's right there with uh, the Starbucks, the small coffees at Starbucks. Five dollars for the cup of Duke and drink. Yeah, um, Starbucks small coffees are like five seventy five, so five sixty nine. It's it's right there with Starbucks prices. Two drinks. Mm. But this thing is delicious. Well, that's good. That's this thing's good. Thing. This Amazing. thing's good. That malt, that little bit of malted, and that chocolate, and that little hint of coffee. That thing's really good. It's I want to give it more than a 9.5, but I'm not trying to go overboard. But that thing's really good. I would have a hard time not getting that again. I think Dad needs to try that. You want to try this coffee again? Maybe yeah. it's cooled down a little I bit. It's hot. I, hope I should have so. just left the stopper out. Yeah, it should. It's really good. Get the, yeah. get the lined up. Really, yeah, I'm trying to. There we go. But I love Caribou Coffee's color, like this teal blue. I love this color. It's kind of a pretty color. I can drink the coffee. Does it? It, it tastes better than Starbucks. Yeah, you, you, oh, it's better. Yeah, it's better Dad than couldn't. Uh, yeah, Dad uh, couldn't drink the black coffee. I from threw Starbucks. it away. I threw yeah. it away. It tasted burnt. You said from Starbucks, the black coffee. This coffee tastes fairly decent. It's so damn hot. It's so hot. I have to let it cool down a little bit more. Guys, I got to try this. This pumpkin uh, cake pop. How much they charge me for this thing? It's got a good flavor to that it. That coffee? Yeah, it's got a good flavor to it. This pumpkin cake pop, they charge me three dollars and twenty nine cents, and I'm pretty sure Starbucks is about the same price. I gotta, I gotta take a bite of this. It's gooey like the cake pops are at Starbucks. It's very similar. It's warm in the car, so this is kind of getting a little like gooey, more gooey or like on the outside. It's got a good pumpkin cinnamon thing. Um, I'm just here, Dave. You want me to do something with that? It's hot. Yeah, I know. It's I'm gonna hot. I'm gonna do something with it here. Put it back in this hole. Okay. So, um, they got a um, birthday cake one, and they got a chocolate cake pop. Um, pumpkin spice really isn't my thing, okay, guys. Uh, this does have a good flavor to it, but it's just not, it's not hitting me, okay? If you like pumpkin spice thing, you're going to love this, okay? You're going to love it. Um, I would recommend this to you. So I got to give it like a 7.5. I would recommend it if you like pumpkin spice, but I, I would say if you like chocolate butter or the birthday cake ones at, at Starbucks, I think you're going to like the chocolate or birthday cake here at, at Caribou Coffee because it's very similar. The inside is gooey like the Starbucks ones. It's got all that same kind of texture. The chocolate coating is good. You know what I mean? So it's very comparable to the cake pops, cake pops that I've had from Starbucks. That's as good as I can get on them. I need to get another bite of my sandwich really quick. Get some of the oh, sugar. Get some good. of the sugar. It was good. <laughs> good. It's good. It was good. Mm -hmm. yeah, my sandwich was good. <laughs> Everything about my sandwich, I couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't complain about it. Oh, good. And the coffee don't have no after effects, so I. I What do you mean? It don't have no aftertaste. Oh, okay. Uh, so, I guess that's what I have to So you expect. definitely like it better than Starbucks. We already have. Yeah. Right. Um, I don't think anything will beat uh, McDonald's. McDonald's. But, <laughs> but, but uh, if I came here again. But I would uh, drink that coffee. Yeah, you would drink that coffee. Okay, that's that's the question I was going to ask. Yeah. I definitely got to have him try that malted mocha. I think he would like it in the hot. I think he would really like that. If he was wanting that chocolate, a hot chocolate vibe, it's not it's quite as strong, like as sweet as hot chocolate, but that malted flavor in there and that cough. Oh, I got to get another drink. I just got to get another drink. Mm. I might even like this ice, guys. No, her, that coffee is pretty good. That coffee is pretty good. Yeah. 
So anyway, that's it. Are you about ready to let these guys go? Yes. Uh, I'm full of trying everything. So guys, I we recommend Caribou Coffee as of now. I mean, I think it's it's. It, I think we Caribou recommend Coffee is an eight. An eight. The experience of it. An eight. An eight. Yeah. Uh, I I recommend them, guys. Like I said, we're new customers, so we don't know. But they got a lot of different drink options, which I liked. You can get them ice, blended, hot. A lot of them. They had a lemonade options with different flavored uh, flavorings in the lemonade or just plain lemonade. They got boosted lemonade. They got some um, almost look like smoothie drinks. I'm not really sure what all they have. But they got a lot of options. So I'm gonna. The price is a little bit out of this world. Well. Their prices are a little less than Starbucks. Really? A little less. Yes, Starbucks is up there on the prices. No, and this is just this is just under Starbucks by a few cents, well, guys. Where's the black coffee? Uh, what's the price on that? Oh. Um, Dad's little black coffee was two dollars and seventy nine cents. Okay. So. But anyway, that's it. Let's let's let these guys go. Okay. Let these guys go. Okay, guys. We hope you all have a great lunch, a great dinner, or a great late night snack. But most of all, guys, we hope you have a great day. A great day and a better tomorrow. And God bless you all. Yes, guys. God bless. Come back tomorrow. See what we're eating. See what we're reviewing. See if we like it or not. Until tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye bye.